Hello, baseball fans, and welcome. Interleague Baseball on MLB The Show. It's the Washington Nationals and the Detroit Tigers. John Shambi, Chris Singleton with you, singing a guy who could change this game with one swing of the bat, Joey Gallo. He, of course, leads their team at home runs. Yeah, Boog, he's been such a force at the plate, and it seems like every time he connects, the ball is traveling out of the ballpark. So when you have such a threat like that, other guys in the lineup should get good pitches to hit because they're trying to get those outs instead of having to face him in a big situation. First pitch coming your way next. And yeah, the batter now, Chloe Frazier. She's a hitter who does it all. With the lack of contact in today's game, this player hits for contact so she delivers average, but there's on base and slugging too. And there's a rocket into the outfield. Throw back in quickly. First and second now with nobody out. And that knock bumps her hitting streak into double digits, Chris. She's hitting 10 straight. Yeah, and on a nice trajectory. Average going up, OBP. Everything she's doing at the plate right now just seems to be working. So now it's the four-hole hitter, Kerry Carpenter. So RBI spot, but Chris, this is a guy that is not really swinging the bat all that well here. In this situation, you have a real good opportunity to get swings and misses and record a strikeout. I think you attack him in this spot. Four pitches. That's an easy walk, man. He could have walked me right there, Boo. The last one wasn't even close. And here is C.J. Crone. One, two, bottom of the first. The pitch. All right, grounder into the outfield for a knock. One runs in to the plate, and she's out. Now back, second baseman, Chloe Frazier. On the ground to the left, the and it goes just foul. One out, base is empty. There's a swing and a drive. He got a free ball to soup with that home run. That's her third home run of the series. And they add on. It's 3-1. That's her third straight game with a homer singing. This player is on fire, boo. These kinds of streaks just don't come around too often. Looks like this hitter was looking out over the plate, but she was ready to turn on the inside fastball. So direct to the pitch. Absolutely. Here's Eddie Rosario. Eddie. Tying run is at first. Top half of inning number four. On the ground, two ball. To second for one. And a run scores on the double play. Well, first and third, nobody out. You're thinking you've got it lined up for a pretty big inning right here. So that double play is pretty deflating. They get the run in, but now they're starting all over. Back at Comerica Park, ready to go for the last half of the inning. And now it's the switch hitting second baseman, Chloe Frazier. in the pitch that one is absolutely belted and it's into the gap now she'll turn for second not stopping she's going for three the relay throw the tag and she's out trying for three runner on at first with one gone and up next for Detroit Chloe Frazier and it may be a long shot but a triple here will give her the cycle Swing and a high fly ball down the left field line, but hooking foul. Corbin, multi-time all-star, he features a sinker, a slider, a four-seamer, and he works in a changeup. 
Well, pretty clear to me, she's trying to go deep right there, but you got to get a pitch that you can handle. The 0 2. Left field, way back there. Goodbye, Homer! Another Homer. Her second home run of the game, and they add to the lead. It's 8 5. That's their fourth home run of the game. They can't stop, and they won't stop hitting home runs in this one, Boog. They're clearly feeding off of each other at the dish. No matter how this outing ends, that pitch is going to haunt him for a while. An 0-2 mistake. That's supposed to be a pitch out of the zone. He left it in a spot that the hitter could do some damage with, and that's exactly what she did. And welcome back to the ballpark. And now, Eddie the Rosario. Eddie Rosario. And the 0-2. And he hits a ground ball right side. Frazier. Gathers and throws to first. And a quick out the number batter. one. The catcher, Kaybird Ruiz. After four wins in a row, you start to think a little bit that you're on a roll, and that's the momentum that just takes on a life of its own. Players start hitting up and down the lineup. You never know who's going to come up with the big hit, who's going to come out of the bullpen and get the big outs, but it's a good feeling, and you want to extend it.